Welcome grade 10 and welcome to Science 10 Online Lessons. At this point, let's review our grade 8 and grade 9 Earth Science lessons before we proceed to grade 10 lessons. This is the second part of the video. Before we begin, let's play four peaks, one word. Ready? Okay, so for this set of pictures, you, as, you, uh, as you can see, you have volcano, magma, craters. Okay, so the definition is, it is a sudden and violent shaking of the ground as a result of movement within the Earth's crust or volcanic action. What do you think is the answer? Okay, they are volcano. So volcanoes, they are a natural opening in the surface of the earth where molten rocks, hot gases, smoke, and ash are rejected. So as you can see in the picture, okay, so magma chamber is resided inside the volcano where it is the res reservoir or ma of magma beneath the earth's surface. The vent is the opening of the volcano through which molten rocks erupts to the surface and crater is a funnel-shaped pit at the top opening of the volcanoes. So, we have two types of volcanoes. We have active and inactive. Active volcanoes are volcano that has erupted within the last 10,000 years, while inactive volcanoes are volcanoes that hasn't exhibit any historical record of eruption in the past 10,000 years. So we have two types of inactive volcanoes. We have dormant volcanoes, which erupts, then enters a period of inactivity, and extinct volcanoes, which volcanoes where they are inactive for a very long period of time. So these are volcanoes in the Philippines. So as you can see, most of the volcanoes in the Philippines are active. So in terms of volcanoes and shape, so the shape of volcanic cone depends on the three factors. These factors are also associated with the viscosity of the magma. Number one, magma composition. Number two, magma temperature. And number three, amount of gas. In terms of shape, volcanoes has different types. So number one is the shield volcanoes. It has a broad dome-shaped structure and it and expels basaltic lava with few pyroclastic materials. It contains non-viscous lava flow. Example is the Mauna Loa in Hawaii. So these are some, picture, some of the pictures of shield volcanoes. So, Mauna Loa in Hawaii erupted last 1984. So, look at the picture. Another type of volcano in terms of shape is cinder volcanoes. It, they have they has steep slopes and represents the last phase of an activity in a region of older basaltic flows. In exam, as example, we have Paricutin in Mexico. So, in, in Mexico, okay, the famous cinder volcano is Paricutin, which erupted last 1952. Another example is composite volcano, also known as stratovolcanoes, consists of alternating layers or strata of lava flows and pyroclastic materials. Examples are Mount Vesuvius in Italy and the Mayon volcano in the Philippines. So, this is the Mayon Volcano in the Philippines, which erupted last 2013. And the last type of volcano are caldera. They are large crater formed when the sides of a, of a crater collapses. Example is, the, is our own Taal Volcano. So, one 